I don't think he's quite like pushed it through and, and become the dominant guy he really can in the run game. Because yeah. in, in pass pro, uh, you guys got the tape and you guys watch and you're good at what you do. I mean, it, this guy's close, you know, in the pass game to being a lockdown guy. In the run game, you just like to see him click off, you know, the uncommon look a little bit quicker and, and you'd like to see him be a little bit more of a fit. But he was challenging Ross, you know, when it comes to knockdowns in games. I think the last game it was like 11 to 8 mm. or something like that. So he's coming on. We, we most certainly like to have it happen faster where he's just the guy we want him, we all want him to be. You see Ross uh, making it in the NFL, and how are you going to replace him? He really is this, <clears throat> he's a classic example of Iowa fifth year guy really taking off, I think. Yeah, you know, I'm kind of in hopes, you know, outside of the hard work it takes to find a guy, but I'm kind of in hopes that, that the system and just the time allows for a guy to kind of step in there and do it, you know, like Ross did. I mean, you know, my understanding is for a while, like, man, we can't get this guy, you know, kind of going like he ain't stepping up. And then all of a sudden he's had really two nice years. I wish he would have played a little more last year. Mm -hmm. um, I think he's got a, more than a shot to play in the NFL. Mm -hmm. You know, how he trains and how he performs in the um, interviews and then his testing, he'll take care of himself because mm -hmm. he's a really good tester. And I think, I think Keegan Render's right there too. I think mm -hmm. that he's got a legitimate chance. Mm -hmm. I think if Fergie could have stayed healthy, I mean, maybe he would have got a little bit of a peak. Mm -hmm. the, the, the NFL guys, right, either love our guys because they know they've been into um, like NFL type verbiage, you know, pass protection wise and run game. And so I think those guys all have a pretty decent shot of, um, you know, pushing through and making it, making a team. Mm -hmm. How would you assess Alaric Jackson's progress right now? <clears throat> really good. I think AJ quietly has become a really good run player. You know, I think pass protection wise, you know, he got beat against Penn State. He got, you know, beat against Minnesota. But outside of that, you know, he's really developed into a pretty, pretty solid left tackle. I, I'd like to see him be cleaner. You know, he ends up chasing some blocks and pass pro at times. But if we can get his hands to be a little more efficient, he should have a huge, huge ball game. And then, you know, moving into spring, really look for big things. With the turnover that you're going to have, 